Hello, everybody! As you probably know, it's me, the Red Mage Crow, and welcome back to Moon, where we are joined like normally we'd be do with Cloud. Don't lie to them. Oh, I'm sorry. With Cloud! Hi. Cloud is technically on Tuesdays. <laughs> <laughs> Technically. Oh, dude, you made them mad. Huh? That we're not doing Yoke Walk on this Tuesday. It's not my- it's not my fault. <laughs> no, it's not. I just thought it was funny that they were like, um... Actually, I think it was Barco who was like, Don't worry, they'll be playing it in four days. <laughs> okay, I was like, what the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, oh man, I'm still trying to get the bunny too. What money? Not money, bunny. Oh! Yes. So I was that like... cat can be a yokai in her team. Mm hmm. And guess what? What? Another reason I'm pissed off today. Uh oh. The check engine light went off. Uh. Why? I don't know. I'm still gonna take my car in mm -hmm. and get it looked at because it's still popped up and it's still worth a look at. Mm -hmm. And not to mention that like I had other like codes that needs to be fixed as well, so might as well, you know? Yeah. Might as well indeed. Especially seeing as how I have the warranty that I purchased. Yes. It only lasts for a year, so I better get it fixed! You better. Guess what I did yesterday. What'd you do yesterday? Uh, I, I played Final Fantasy VIII. Ooh, finally! <laughs> it's been so long since you played Final Fantasy VIII. Yeah, last time I recorded was apparently in July. Wow, it's almost like you were <laughs> in a trance of sword, Wink Wonk. <laughs> I was in a coma. You were in a coma. I don't think mm -hmm. that I don't think that's a plot point in Final Fantasy IX, unless you count blank. How dare you? <laughs> How dare you hurt me like this with my boy Blink? I mean, like, would you say that Blink was in kind of a coma-like state? In a way, yeah, he was petrified. What is that song that has petrified in the light? I don't know, but I know comatose. I'll never live without an overdose of you. <laughs> I don't want to live. I don't want to breathe. It's really like, I was petrified. That's all I remember. Oh. <laughs> That sounds so familiar, actually. It does! That's why I'm like, where the fuck have I heard that line from? Oh my god. That's so gonna drive me petrified. batty now. I was pet. <gasps> First I was afraid! I was petrified! That thinking was how I could Thank never you. live without you by my side. That's the song. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> I was like, no, that sounds way too familiar. Why do I know this? And it's because I always sing this! Yeah. It's funny, like, when you have, like, a line and you're just like, where the fuck <laughs> have I heard this song before in my brain? And why is it not leaving me alone? Yeah, like, all the time in Final Fantasy XIV when I was playing with my friend, <laughs> uh, every time that I was a tank, I'd be like, I will survive! And he'd be like, dude, why do you always sing when you get low? And it's like, because it, oh, it always helps me. <laughs> it is what it is. Oh. I get him go. I got a good feeling about today. Somehow, no gay. Oh, wait a minute. There he is. Well, hello, no gay. I'm glad to see you. Let me borrow that. No gay is his son. This plane design is good. Now, it all depends on how you throw the angle and in 
Oh, 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 a 44.25 degree angle. Is that... What's that say? Uh... You, you, don't, it, you don't know the math here, Cloud? Is that an M2 divided by P1? I think that's pi. Alright. <laughs> An initial velocity of 0 0.8 will probably work. No, 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 Cloud, you gotta say it right. Sir T-R. Um, yeah, I don't um, know what it says. But Cloud, it's, so t it's so tiny. But Cloud, you're the it... math nerd of the two of no, us. No, I'm not. Do not lie to them. <laughs> but they're basically saying it, saying that the angle is... 0 0.31830988886 meters squared. Is that what that says? I mean, that's the 44.25 degrees angle, and then, like, the angle is that. All right, then! <laughs> the song! Yay! Wow, would you look at that? It really flew! It's flying wild! Yeah! Look at him, he's so happy! Thank you, Nogi! It took longer than it shoulda. I finally kept my promise to my kid. Oh well, I barely did anything. Though if you're happy, that sure is great. Well, bye. Oh god. <laughs> He's so happy. Yeah. Thank you. Without your encouragement, I might have given up before now. Took me longer than I thought, but I did it. I kept my promise. Yay. Good for you, my guy. Bill B is a good dad. Dude, I want to be as good of a dad as he is one day. Yeah. To my adopted child. <laughs> you have a... Oh, God, what was the, the daughter in a Spy, spy X family? Oh, uh, yeah, Anya's! Anya's, yeah. See, adoption's good. <laughs> Adoption is good. We don't need any more people on this planet. I agree. Take good care of that. That's yours forever. I don't want okay, so it. So now that, now that you've done that, uh, you could actually do the next part of No Gay. Yeah, but he's not giving me anything to work with here. Yeah, because he doesn't want to. Um. Oh, also you have to start on the rocket. He's a Houdini! What happened? He was on the screen and then he disappeared. But we have to start on the rocket. Uh, oh no, you have to finish the rocket, actually. Well, we haven't... Have to go... I know, you haven't started the, the rocket at all. Well, not I a... think it's Nogay's father. You have to start the rocket. Mm. Um, and no guy yet to finish it. Hmm. Which you'll have to be in his room at night on Solar Day. Oh, lovely. E. Wait. Today is Solar Day, though. Yeah, but you can't do it until you finish the rocket. Ah. Yeah, so you can't do anything with him at the moment still. Shame. I know. You know, I like the fact oh. that I can teleport, but I really hate the fact that I have to walk all the way back. I mean, this is music fitting. Yeah. Meh <laughs> meh. You're too soon, Cloud. <laughs> no. 
He walked by it, so I had to do it. Oh, he didn't do the noise, though. Yeah, because you weren't looking at him. I, I was looking at him. You weren't looking at him directly enough. I changed it to night by using the action button. <laughs> Don't lie. Oh, also, uh... Oh, shoot. I'm, I'm not on the page anymore. Uh... Valley of the Wind! Do you have song 34? Ooh, you know what? Because, like, that that's the, uh... That's the one we need in order to talk to the flowers, I take it. Yes, yeah. I do. Cool. Then you're good. Oh, God. All right. Might, I, I was gonna go to sleep, but we might as well try to talk to the flowers. Time to be a tree hugger. Oh dear God! It's alive. I can talk to it. I can't. Oh. I think I just gotta activate them. Oh look, he's up there. What the freak? Mother effer. Oh yeah, you have to activate all of them. Oh. Waking them all, crow. I'm trying. I hope there's not one over there. Right? There's one over there, isn't Oh, no. Got them all. Got them all. What was that? Got some love. But there's also an additional noise. I cannot eat that. Why do you have it then? Oh well. Hmm. Well, I guess I might as well go to sleep. Yeah. Because tomorrow's gonna be Crescent Day and we're gonna need like a full day in order to like get over to like uh, the, the weird guy's house. Dr. Hager? Yes. So that we can, uh, get the, uh, guy to talk to me again, you know? Oh, the, the mayor. Yeah. Yeah. And also, this is actually the very first time where we didn't end on a that is love, this is love. Yep, and because that we're in the circus, because you're a clown. Wow! <laughs> Sorry, the timing was great. I had to see it. <laughs> wow, I at least I'm Pomey, I guess. Yeah. Which means you're the ringleader, which the, the ringmaster? You're the ringmaster, which means you're the freaking teeth guy. I'd rather be bubble. Then you could pop me anytime. <laughs> God dang. <laughs> Let's see what love you've got today, Crow. Please toy airplane fly nicely. You cheered up the desert flowers. You cleared the highest. <laughs> uh, Zingus Khan. Zingus Khan level. You watched the monster concert. That is love. This is love. And the love of all the souls of the animals. Onzo. Eric. Beck. Jimmy. Keith. Philip. Congratulations, that was a lot of hearts. Crow, your love has deepened further. Crow, you have reached level 27. Love. I almost thought that said Yakuza. 
No, oh, I mean, I would love to be a Yakuza. <laughs> I, I, I think I've already made, like, an executive decision. I think I'm going to play Yakuza 1. I need to play that. Yaku like, I keep, I keep wanting to go back to Yakuza 0. Mm-hmm. And, like, I, I don't want to go back to Yakuza 0 because I know <laughs> that if I go there, I'm never coming back. <laughs> love Yokozuna. Your next level, you need five more love. Did you know? That love still dots this world? Yes, yes, I do. Yes. But, uh, speaking of Yakuza, mm -hmm. I saw something trending on Twitter the other day. Uh huh. And. <laughs> It was so like I know nothing about Yakuza really, you know, other than mm -hmm. the song. Bakamita. Uh huh. And then the crazy guy who does the dancing. Kiryu Chan. The... Yes, that guy. <laughs> I don't even know who it is. He has like that very sparkly jacket. Yes. And uh, so, uh, for some reason, uh, people mm -hmm. on the wrong side of the ideas <laughs> I'll just say mm -hmm. uh, was trying to use the main guy uh -huh, as a as a anti-trans person mm -hmm. like icon but he's like but the most uh, he, trans exactly, icon ever exactly he's like like they showed a bunch of like lines where he's like being very supportive of people yeah, I think that there was, like, one quest that I did, and I was like, Wow, Kiryu, you're very progressive! Yeah, and, and it's, what's really funny is, um, on Twitter, where mm -hmm. it said, they were, like, trying to pro promote this, mm -hmm. right below it, it said, This is a lie? Like, uh, what's his name again? Karuzu? Uh, Kiryu? Kiryu is a progressive guy. Yeah, like, holy cow. <laughs> It's it's just so funny because usually um, the Twitter thing only pops up when people are trying to like spread like really really bad information. Mm -hmm. But this is for like a, a character. Yeah, that. And it, and it, it popped up saying that what he what they're saying is wrong. <laughs> Ignore what they're saying. He's actually really cool. <laughs> yeah, like he's like, what the hell? Cloud. Yeah. We established the Hagar Invention Foundation in the third year of Cloud! Hi! Since then, we've spared right. no expense to our tireless pursuit of in innovation. Cloud! You, yeah. During your third birthday, this game was made! I'm very young. <laughs> I'm just a baby. Actually, when I was three years old, I almost died. <laughs> I mean, you know, to be fair... I almost died on multiple occasions as a young lad. Mm-hmm. Like, Me asthma- encephalitis. Oh. Well, <laughs> I, I had asthma attacks. I basically, like, jumped into my neighbor's pool without oh, knowing boy. how to swim, mind you. Uh-huh. Um, I climbed the- I climbed on top of the house and got on the roof. Oh, that's dangerous. Um... You know, just like a bunch of stuff that, you know, a child should not be doing. Agreed. So, yeah, I died all, almost like five times my age. <laughs> also, do you want to choose some music? But this one is so nice. But... <laughs> okay. Uh... What do you got? What a loser baby. <laughs> Dude, I'm like... I, I watched like a video, right? Mm -hmm. Of these people who, um... Who I very much like. Uh-huh. And they did a, uh... I like this one. Uh, a thing for, like, uh, Loser Baby, right? Oh, did they? Yes. Good or bad? The original people did it a lot better, I feel. 
Um, but even then, uh, they had to change the lyrics. Oh. Because, um, what happened is that when they, uh, when they, God forsaken brain, it would get demonetized. Oh. Because of the, uh, subject matter? Yes. And so they basically had to change it, but people were calling them cowards in the freaking comment section. Mm -hmm. And it's like, come on, guys. If they changed the lyrics, I'm sure they had a good reason. Yeah. What day is today? Oh, it's Christmas Day, so we can have a meeting. Yeah. Yay! It's the reason I'm here. Hmm. So after this, what do we do? We can try uh, to get the elephant. Oh yeah, that's, that was also that. Cause what is the next day? Um, after Christmas Day, it is Blaze Day. Yeah, so we can do that anytime. Then Tears Day will come back for the another meeting, and on Echoes Day we could do Robbie. Yeah. Robbie? said Robbie. Roby. Roby! Oh yeah, Ruby. Ru not Ruby and Max. Ruby and Max. Max and Ruby. Ruby and Max. Oh, yeah, on Echo Day morning, go to room 113. Ooh. They're going to roll out the new Reman drone model soon. Seems like, yeah. Then what will happen to us? Uh, robots life, like tears in rain. The same model as Lady Techno? That's what I hear. And they just kind of talk about it again. Mm -hmm. I guess this okay. meeting's over. Yep, that meeting's over. You spin my head right round, right round. Alright, so I guess the next thing to do is to try to get that elephant. I feel like we've done pretty much everything else. Uh, what you mean? Um, if anything, first things first. Give me one moment. I do not want to. <gasps> But I gotta, I, I don't want to make a mess all over floor. Oh, can't throw up? No, I got to pee. Oh, okay. You can go pee. Okay, i pee right back. Okay. Or I pee right back. <laughs> After these matches, I'm back! No! Oh. But. Did you watch the video I sent you earlier today? Uh, which one? The one with the guy who jumped into a painting. Oh, yes! <laughs> oh, dude, this one has a naked man in it. Here I go! Uh -huh. Yeah. <laughs> You're like, perfect. <laughs> yeah, that's from uh, Dungeon Meshi. Mm-hmm. Have you watched that yet? I have not. Oh my god, it's so good. I haven't really been able to do many of uh, anime in a long time. Typically, I have to be forced in with another person to watch anime. Mm. Yeah, my only issue with it is it's on Netflix. I see. I'd rather watch it on Crunchyroll or on <laughs> Blu-ray, you know? Mm-hmm. Oh. Hey, bless you. You heard nothing. I heard everything. <laughs> By the way, mm -hmm. you know what I have been very much thinking about playing lately? Persona 3? I mean, yes, I've been thinking about that one too. <laughs> I've been thinking about that one. But, um, so, have you ever heard of the Jumpstart games? Uh... 
are you talking about the ones on like the little kitty things for learning or are we talking about um like kickstarter so like uh oh i thought he was like right there on the floor <laughs> if only no it was like a bunch of computer games that they made for like very specific grades yeah the kid kid games yeah that's the first thing i said yeah okay so i thought you meant like um I thought you meant, like, uh, the Leapfrog type, uh, games. I mean, that, I was kind of thinking about those, yeah, but they're kind of similar. A bit, except one's a computer and, like, the other one was kind of, like, a little weird thing. But... Weird device. But, yeah. I've been thinking about playing those games again. Really? Cause, uh, yeah. Because, like, um... I never beat... One of them. Huh. And the reason for that, right? Mm -hmm. Is because, for whatever reason... Don't move, you son of a gun. For whatever the reason, none of our progress ever got saved. Hmm. So, like, there's... This... Think... Oh, go ahead. I think, they're... I think they're made that way so that you keep playing them over and over again. Yeah, but, like, it's so annoying. And I want to just, like, really sit down and beat, beat it. Get back here! You son of a gun! Gotta wait. But, yeah, I just, I just want to, like, sit down, play either the robot one or the clue finder one, uh -huh. and just, like, beat it. Ah. Uh -huh. Well, good luck with that. Yeah, the thing is that it gets really repetitive, though. <laughs> so it's like, yikes, man. <laughs> Get him. He doesn't want to come down. Get him. Maybe if I throw a Yenom at his god dang head. Or a rock at him. gonna fly for a long period of time and then is going to die. <laughs> Come here. Drop down. Be my friend. Nah. Wants to be a jerk? I'll figure. No, you don't. Get back here. <laughs> Like, if I had to think about which one of those Jumpstart games was my favorite, it was probably the robot one. Okay. I never played any of them. Oh my god! What? He flew really fast! Yeah. But yeah, it was like a robot brother with an evil older sister. I could relate. Could really I can relate with that. Why won't you ever come down? Because. It's about to be nighttime again. Is there like a a Tuesday night? So this is the next meeting. Oh. I thought that... We're, we're still fine. Yeah, but, like, I thought I thought that you were saying that we need to wait for Tears Day night in order for him to, like, come down. No. Because now it's night and he's just going to sleep here. Just, wait, I thought he moves even at night. I don't think he does. We can, we can stay around and check. What's he called? Um... Cycloliphant. How do you spell that? C Y C. C Y C. Oh, there he is. Wow. Wow. Guys, character art. <laughs> so <laughs> freaky. I don't I'm gonna doubt send it. it. 
I'm gonna send it to you because you can. <laughs> Luckily, uh, I have a phone. Rare. <laughs> Solution. Oh, <laughs> Told you. Uh, we'll occasionally fly between the mushrooms on the path of the haunted house. The protagonist must wait at the lower right mushroom since it's the only one where the soul is accessible as the thing flies past. Really? Okay. Yep. The way to the lower right. So they're saying when he flies from that one to that one. Yeah. That's going to be rough. Yeah. But tomorrow's going to be a uh, water day, right? Tuesday, yes. Mm. And on Tuesday is when you want to head back to the place. We might want to just head back there now. No, you're fine. You're fine. You can make it. You think? Yep. Because he makes that transition, like, very late into the day. They're fine. Do I have a teleporter, maybe? Mm. Yes. yes, I do. So you're fine. I see someone sending me a bunch of uh, Sanji-related stuffs. Gosh. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. Uh-huh. So you know how you like, I'm a loser, baby, a loser. Yes. <laughs> I love that song. Sanji and Zoro. Uh-huh. No, dude, uh, that's actually how I found the song. Really? Before I watched Has Been Hotel, mm -hmm. uh, someone did fan art of Zoro and Sanji with the song text of Loser Baby is made for them. Wow. And I was like, what the heck is Loser Baby? And so I looked up the song and like, I like this song. Now I want to watch the show. And I watched the entire <laughs> show. <laughs> That's what got me, man. I think I sent you the image of that. Uh, did but if you? I did, it was like a long time ago. If you did, then like, I don't remember it, unfortunately. Uh, again, it would have been quite some time because it was like before I watched it. Mm-hmm. Uh, how do I? There we go. Oh, he moved. Welcome it's to win like... the game, guys. <laughs> and it was at night too. See, he'll still do it. I wonder if I could find it again. Cause I did not reblog that one. <laughs> Maybe. Uh. Hello, Tears Day. Dude, and like, he doesn't like, he, he makes the transition from like, that one to that one really fast. So I gotta be on top of it. Yeah, you do. I don't wanna be here oh. anymore. And guess what else? What else? So, you know how I'm in, I've been into Delicious in Dungeon? Yes. And my favorite character is Cholchuk? Yes. His Dendroid is coming out soon. Oh no! Oh yes! <laughs> I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna do it. Can't stop me. I'm getting that one. Do what makes you happy, but also remember your financial situation. Of course. I'm cautious. Don't worry about it. I'm pretty sure he'll move to the closer right, back to the left. And then he'll make the really fast transition. Yes, that's the one you want to grab him on. And while you're doing that, I'm trying to still find that image. Dude, if I miss this, oh my god. <laughs> I'm gonna be so <laughs> upset. I like the song though. It is a good I'm song. I'm just like chilling <laughs> while you were in pain. <laughs> God, I'm in pain right now. Trust me. I'm in the blink and you'll miss it kind of deal right now. <laughs> Get it. <laughs> yes, son of a gun. You got it. 
I got them now, the son of a fish. I'm trying to find it. Oh, well, we got it. Okay, so now let's go ahead and use the teleporter. Get home, teleport. I gotta remember to eat it. Consume. Wow. Consume. Wow, 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 Oh yeah. <laughs> What's up? Oh, I found the panel where uh, Sanji calls uh, Niji an idiot. Uh huh. And Niji's response is like, "Idiot! You, you dare insult me! You, you Sanji!" <laughs> 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 so he can't even think of an insult. He has to say his name insultingly. Oh my god, Niji is such an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, out of all the brothers, he's the worst. <laughs> Good hair, but the worst. You, you know you know who would be the best um last straw hat? Uh Vivi? No. It's totally gonna be Vivi. It's totally gonna be Vivi, but I can hope and pray that it's Katakuri. Uh, I would love that too, actually. Like, just think of, thinking about it, like, he could get donuts from Sanji every single day. It's the best. I and, love it. And no one would judge his mouth either. Mm -mm. Nobody. I love it. I mean, unless, like, Sanji got, like, very annoyed at him, in which he'd probably use it as, like, an <laughs> insult. But more so in a playful manner. He, he would say it in a playful manner, but I think like if he knows that Katakuri is uncomfortable with it, I don't think he will. I don't think he would either. Z Zoro, however, would probably use it as kind of like a goad. He probably would. I'm still trying to find it. Boop, 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 boop. Oh, aha. I'm getting close to it now. But yeah, I'm thinking about it, and I don't think that there's really too many more things for us to really get. I found it. You found it? I found it. Lovely. I'm sending it your way so you can see the beautifulness of Loser Baby with Zoro and Sanji. <laughs> oh. I feel like I have seen this before, but I, I never made the connection to Loser Baby from this. Yeah, you have to like read the line right yeah. above it. That's great. Yeah, so that's that's what made me search for the song because like I was like, what is this song that they're referencing? <laughs> okay, so let's see, right? How how many more animals do we have to save? You have to check the TV. Yeah, we'll check the TV. Um, I think that we got roughly just about every single one person's hearts, except for the charging robot guy, which we will be getting. Mm -hmm. Um, which the, I think is mayor. actually tomorrow, and the mayor, which is probably going to be tonight. Um, it's Echo Day, I think it said. Well, Echo Day is for the charging robot guy. Yes. Which is tomorrow. And... Uh, no. No, it's not tomorrow? This is Tears Day, right? Uh, yes. Yeah, so it's two more days. Ah, uh, okay. So you gotta get through Leaves Day and Coins Day to get to Echo Day. Ah, uh, I totally forgot about uh, Leaves Day and Coins Day. Yeah. <laughs> I'm worried the lady hates us. <gasps> is that so? Is that all you have to say? Say, ain't it kind of weird to have a club in a town full of robots? Does that have something to do with Lady Techno? Yes. So, are, are you sure that it's three times? That's what it said. What's supposed to happen after the third time? Uh... 
Okay, the player must talk to the level three times, after which they must approach Lady Techno at Echo Day. Oh, lovely. <laughs> while she's sitting in the VIP room. So many things on Echo Day. Yeah. But at least we have to be at the charging station robot thing. Oh my God. At the morning of Echo Day. At the morning of Echo Day, so. Why did you say Echo? Deku. Deku. I know, that Deku. was- Deku. That's where my brain went to. Fucking deck you. Did you know? Mm hmm. I hate Deku. You made that known to me, like, <laughs> off the get go. Yeah. It's funny, though, because, like, I, I feel like people who hear me say I hate Deku, their instant reaction is, like, oh, you hate them because he's a crybaby. Blah, 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 blah. Like, no. I like crybaby characters. I like Sanji from One Piece. I like Takato from T Digimon Tamers. They're both crybabies, and I love them. But you know what they're not? Um... Deku. <laughs> yeah. They're... N basically, they're not some... They're, they're not... The reason why you, you don't like Deku is because Deku... Though he had a dream that he wanted to do, he never actually prepared to, like, go into that, uh, line of job. He never exactly. trained his body. He trained his exactly. mind mentally, but he never physically trained. Yes. And that's why I hate him, because he's not like Rock Lee, who trained his body so that he can make up for his lack of chakra? Yes. So that he can still fight with the other ninjas. So Lee, Lee, Rock Lee, mm -hmm. commendable character. Love yes. him. Deku, fuck him. <laughs> yes. The yep. only thing he's ever done is put himself in danger trying to save Bakugo mm -hmm. multiple times, making Bakugo a beautiful damsel in distress. But still, the point still stands that he was an idiot running into danger when he wouldn't be able to help. Yes. And only causing more problems. And yet, All Might's like, you were the type who I want to give my power to, instead of the actual cool character with the funny eyes, who trained his body despite his weird ability, and I'm... making it useful, and then he loses it. I mean, like, yes, okay. So, you're, 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 you're not wrong in that, but honestly, like... Would have been a better hero than Deku. Because he was. I mean, a true hero. <laughs> yes, I freaking love Miro. I I think Miro is definitely like best boy. Thank you. Um, but like also, Deku did have like the the reason he chose Deku was because Deku had the the spirit of a true hero instead of like all these other heroes. Not saying that Miro doesn't, mind you. Uh huh. But like. If you take a look at a lot of the other heroes, especially some of the kids, and e heck, even some of the adults... They're, they're mostly doing it for monetary reasons. Yes, while well, Deku is primarily doing it to actually, like, help people. I never got that from him, though. I always thought he was doing it for selfish reasons because he wanted to be just like All Might. I mean, if, like, then... if, if you really think about it, like, as soon as he found out he didn't have a quirk, then he's like, oh god, my my life is over now because I can't be like All Might. Well, yeah, but you also have to realize that his life is technically over because he doesn't have a quirk. Uh, where Not am I going? Not really, though. He could still be a policeman. He could still help people if you really wanted to. But no, he wanted to be just like All Might. He wanted to be selfish and be that type of hero. And therefore, when he got what he wanted, then he's like, Oh, cool, now I can be a hero, actually. And keep putting himself in danger and not actually helping people because he's just fucking himself up. You know, it's actually funny because I actually read like a... I, I want, <laughs> I'm really angry about that character. <laughs> I, I, I want to say that I read like a Dojin. I don't think it's a Dojin. Doujin is just basically, it's not like a dirty book, it's, right? No, 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 no. Doujin is mostly a fan comic. That's what the terminology is. Uh, it just, a lot of times, Doujin tend to be on the etchy side. I see, but there, okay. There, there are uh, PG-13 and, like, just Gen 
uh, which gen means like you know general audience where mm-hmm. there's nothing really happening. It could be like friendship and just like that. Those exist. Okay. And some of those are very cute. <laughs> yeah. So like I saw like one where basically like. Deku tried to apply at various jobs and they all turned him down because he didn't have a quirk and even the people with like weird quirks were still much more useful than a person without a quirk. Which that then... has to be a do- that has to be a dojin because in the kind of most people who don't have quirks become police officers. <laughs> yeah. But like I mean yeah, he could still be a police officer, but Eh. But he also didn't train his body, so of course they would reject him. <laughs> yeah, no, definitely. Oh, you're gonna uh, go do the but... TV. Oh yeah, that's right. I was like, what? What was I doing? We got so we got into like a heated debate. Yeah, I like, I like, I want to finish this dialogue before I say go to the TV. <laughs> and then, like, I also remembered the one most annoying uh, person that we have to befriend. Uh. Do you know who that is? No. Remember the he... fisherman? Oh god, we forgot about the fisherman. Yes, and he's gonna be the most annoying one because fishing is completely random. <laughs> yeah, but you got better at it. I mean, yes, but like even then, like that day we caught like three boots. True. And so boots aren't going to count towards the fishing thing so mm, no i think the best thing to do for that one is um like save in your house uh-huh the day that the thing is gonna happen or like, the day before i guess it would be um and then try and try and try mm-hmm. and reload your file if it doesn't succeed yeah so we got 43 animals yay so there are eight still souls. eight more. One of them is the bird. Uh huh. And uh, oh, we haven't gone to the haunted house yet. Yeah, it's like right north of the cyclophant. Yeah. And that's probably where all the rest are. Mhm. Because you got all of them from Doctor Haggard's place. Mhm. Techno. Well, no. Well, eh. We just haven't finished the uh, the people who live there. Yeah. So when do we? When is the fishing competition again? Uh. I don't remember. <laughs> Give me a second. I'm gonna need more bait. Regardless. Go get bait. Get the bait, get it, get it, get the bait, gotta get the bait, bait, gotta get the bait, the bait. Um. Oh, my search is coming up as freaking Fire Emblem characters now. I don't want that. <laughs> yes, you do. No. <gasps> I don't really? want to put What's the Fisher guy's name? I don't know. Ratty shoe. No. Uh, cause I put fishing in, and I'm getting like fishing rod, blah 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 blah. It's like no. Do fishing, fishing contest. It's not in here. I it's can do shell well. Hey, this guy. Uh, gamat katsu. Gamakichi! It's solar day. It's solar day? Gotta be on solar day. Lovely. Yeah. A lot of things are on solar day. It definitely feels like it, they did that on purpose to make mm-hmm. it so that you can't really get everything done. Don't worry about it. Hey! Hey, you! But yeah, so I hate Deku. <laughs> Fair enough. I just want to rub it in. He's a terrible person. I was a dead terrible creature. <laughs> well, what about... What about Mineta? Um... Who's Mineta? Uh, Grape Rush. 
<laughs> oh, dude, I like uh, You know what? I like Mineta. <laughs> I mean, I do too, but what about his reason for becoming a hero? Um, his reason? Terrible. <laughs> but execution? He's pretty good at what he does. Bring up her. No, I mean, like, he actually, um, passed and saved, what's his name, Zero. Did you know that's not canon? Is it not? It is not. Is it anime only? It is anime only. <laughs> See, the anime knows. I know because I had I got the manga and I was reading the manga after I watched the anime and I was like, wait, where's the scene? Where's the scene? Where are, where are all the other fights? <laughs> what the fuck? You know that means that the manga is worse because we don't get to see the others fight. Yeah, no, like if anything, I was so I was so dumbstruck because like none of them none of them got any screen time. You know, that makes sense about, like, whole, like people are always complaining about, like, the other characters not getting any screen time when there's this huge list of characters that they could use. Yeah, like, if anything, it, it makes sense, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's disappointing. It is very disappointing. Wah, wah. Wah. <laughs> there we go! <laughs> I, I will say, um, the fact that, like, when he pulls his hair out, though, and he starts bleeding, mm -hmm. and he keeps going to that, succeed, yes. that's still impressive. It is. I like Mineta. I think he's really I like cool. Mineta. I always found, like, the hate on him to be bizarre. I mean, I get that he's a pervert, but, like, who isn't? I mean, here's the thing. Denki... Is mm -hmm. a pervert, and guess what? He gets a pass. Yeah. You know why? Why? He has a cute face. <laughs> <laughs> That's literally it. That's the only reason why. Because you see Denki and Mineta hanging out all the time, being perverts together, and people are like, "No, we, we gotta like take Mineta out of this, the if, the whole thing. It's, he's he's gross. He's disgusting." I mean, to but be fair, Denki because he's cute. Well, well to be fair. Uh huh. Denki hasn't done half of the stuff that Mineta has. He's done enough. I mean, he's done enough, but he hasn't, like, you know, forcefully groped somebody because he's taking advantage of the situation. But didn't he do the whole... I mean, I guess he didn't do that. That was his... He tried to. He tried to peep. I mean, yeah, he, he, he did try to peep. But yet again, they're kids! That's harmless! Mineta will actually go and grope people, you know, just to do it. You know why? Why? Because he's short. <laughs> I mean, fair. Where is that weird guy who's supposed to be in here? I don't know. He said he was gonna be here, didn't he? Yeah, he did. Hmm, I haven't seen him. All I know is, uh, Mineta is a weird little dude. Oh, he is definitely a weird little dude. But, but I don't hate him. Yeah, he's not as bad as everyone. Oh, there he, there is. he is. You know, I think one of the reasons why I don't hate him also mm -hmm. is because he doesn't lie. Yeah, he's very truthful. I feel like, De uh, not Denki, um, Deku mm -hmm. is a liar. He does lie quite a bit. This evolutionary mushroom forest is a multi-space which connects to all dimensions. All right, bye. Oh, there he is. Oh, great! It's fine, Grandpa Day. <laughs> it's Uncle Grandpa. Oh, don't say that. <laughs> Good morning. No. <laughs> the cut. Uh, wait. People sustain themselves on mushrooms, nutritious spores. Did you know that? Happy birthday. I would think that he would only be on the main roads, not the secret road. Here we go. 
it's uh, the Kakunte. It's so, like you. <laughs> See, I don't know how to pronounce that. I always forget. And I reach for it again. Hooray! No! Oh. The Kakunte aren't even very sad that Tutukurui has died. Our fishes are connected here in the dimensional transfer sending six dimensional zone. Full story. Full story, bro. <laughs> I knew right away that you had to come from another world. I don't really want to return to your world that much. A sudden where gray rain falls, steel contraptions on the road, a world that won't wash clean. Sit in front of the picture box, play until sleepy. Oh, no free, man. Dude, the fact that he knows that is actually kind of creepy. <laughs> a three dimensional world you come from is built on the vitality of space and time. The will to change, the will to resist change, in constant conflict. Even in this world, some prefer conflict. So kind of true. Mm -hmm. What do you know about love? Because I don't know nothing about it. That's why I asked you. You know, this kind of talk always makes me think of Wanda from the bar. You and me both, man. We wander. Wandering travelers searching for love. <laughs> <laughs> oh, My body is dust in the wind, man. That's what I always can't stop wandering. I swim helpless between reality and dreams now and forever. If I told you I'd lack lingering attachments in the transit world. I'd be a liar. Good evening. Hark. Stop that. <laughs> Incline your ears. Here you can hear songs of many worlds. What say? Do you hear them? That's not a song. Right. <laughs> I mean, maybe Sorry. to maybe to him it would be a song. Maybe. Driving, walking. The hell is going on? Many objects die and are born, are born and die. Die there, born here. Die here, born there. You see me flutter between therefore and hence for. Hong Kong. There where? Above the sky. At the Dragon Palace, there was a gorgeous queen. All the stars were twinkling. She gave me a souvenir to take home. Here, have a look. She told me I had to give this to you. Have a good day. Got it. I'm carrying too many things. Yeah! I, uh, I, I say get rid of um, the flower. This? Yeah, we don't need it. Really? Yeah. Is he... Is he gone gone? Mm -hmm. I think he's gone gone. Did you eat him? No. But, you know what? This is where we're gonna end this part of the recording! <gasps> and then we can go to the haunted house? And then we're going to the haunted house! Oh, they're playing my song! Yeah! Thank you all so very much for watching! Till next time, I'm gonna listen to my favorite song. Bye, everyone! Kaka! Bye 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 Good morning! Cease! <laughs> Kaka, bye bye! <laughs> bye bye.